Om Shanti, welcome back to your own channel. See the Sudha Truth Lies Within, and we're going to talk about today's that is 25th day of a Holy Blessing, where Supreme Father wants us to transform ourselves by discerning, that means by having the power to decide that what kind of time is going on and what kind of atmosphere we are living in and become loved by all. That means we are able to be molding ourselves so that we don't become a hassle in somebody's life, we don't interfere in somebody's life and we know what is the time, what is the atmosphere and we behave and we react in that manner. So that is known as wisdom as per Baba. So God wants us to use this power and improve in it over a period of time. Let's understand the explanation part. Baba says those who have the power of transformation are loved by all. They are easy in their ideas too. That means they don't push things, they don't force things around and that is what we have to learn. They have the power to mold themselves. That means they are egoless and they can mold themselves, they can become humble very quickly and they know what is the best way to put water when there is a flame which is burning. So God says they would never ask my idea, my plan, my service were so good and so why they, why were they not accepted. That means in terms of when we are planning something out, that's the time one might be very good at certain ideas, one be, might be very good at making plans of service. But God says, why was your plan not accepted? Maybe God had a different plan. Maybe somebody was better suited for that, even if you are good enough. So God says, they'll be humble enough and they'll mold themselves. They won't be beating their head onto the wall or forcing things and pushing things around. That is what God wants us to do, even in our general life, whether it's in our relationships, whether it's in our work, whether it's in our business. That means don't be somebody who's extremely stubborn. So God wants us to become somebody who's humble and remove our stubbornness over a period of time slowly, slowly. So they would never ask for all these things. Then Baba says, to have this consciousness of mine means that there is a loy mixed with them. That means I, me, myself and mine. So my idea, my plan becomes mine. So God says, remove that. Otherwise, you are not like real gold because 24 karat gold can be molded. But if there is an alloy mixed into it, that 24 karat gold takes more time to be bent or molded. So what are we going to be? Either a 24 karat gold or somebody who is like an iron takes much more time to bend. Then God says, so discern the time and the atmosphere Find out, slow yourself down, think about it, what kind of time is it, is it the right time to say certain things, is it the right time to get involved or not and find out the atmosphere, whether the atmosphere around is, is, is it conducive enough to talk about anything and then transform yourself and you will be loved by all and become a number one victorious soul. So certain things can be done or you can attain victory by not even getting involved into certain things in life and one way of attaining victory is that but sometimes when you're not supposed to get involved and you get involved into it it fires back haven't you experienced that in your life also that you were not supposed to get involved because it was going to fire back but you got involved and the situation fired back and you became the person who was not loved by all you became the person who came in between people and you created more troubles rather than more problems. So instead of molding, you became stubborn and you initiated that act and you came in between situations and people and there was more chaos created. So God says for that you'll have to learn the spiritual knowledge, you'll have to meditate and you'll have to find out and through experience you'll get to know when to get involved, when not to get involved, when to mold yourself, when not to mold yourself. So this knowledge is what we learn at Brahma Kumaris and you can do learn it and change your life, change your relationships, change your business, change everything in your life. With this Om Shanti.